And now let us invite contestant number six, Varishan, Children's and Pets. Children's and Pets, Varishan. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, just like all of you, I asked my parents once if I could have a pet. Now, I'm sure you must have a guess the response from my parents. No, every Asian family says the same. The idea of having pets may not always be really embraced, traditional value, critical concerns, and desire for academic focus of the take place. Imagine if all parents allow their children to learn through the companionship of pets. Sounds amazing, isn't it? This experience offers more than just a playmate. It comes a gateway to responsibility and a joyful memories. Did you know, by allowing children to have pets, instill a sense of responsibility deeply within value. The act of caring for another living being nurtures a strong compassion and selfness. Children learn to prioritize the needs of their pets, develop an essential life skill. Asian children often face a huge academic demands, leaving little room for self-expression and emotional release. Pets with their gentle presence offer safe haven for children to share their thoughts and fears. Through this interaction, children cultivate empathy as they learn to care for the needs of another living being. I do have a pet dog, and trust me, it brings a touch of joy to my life. The bonds between my dog and I is a source of unfiltered joy, encouraging creative thinking, and fostering a balanced approach to life. Now, to all of you who want to have a pet, go back, explain my speech, convince your parents, and thank me later. Thank you.